Welcome back to my channel Techno Trend Zone. Today we're diving into some really exciting news about DJI, specifically the upcoming DJI Neo 2 drone. This is a quick update on the surface, but when you really break it down, there's a lot happening behind the scenes that makes this worth talking about. If you're someone who follows drone technology, aerial photography, or DJI product leaks, you're going to want to pay attention to this because the Neo 2 might be one of the most interesting compact drones we've seen in a long time. So let's start with what kicked off the buzz recently, the FCC listing. Yes, the DJI Neo 2 has officially been spotted on the FCC database, thanks to eagle-eyed tech analyst Maro Tandoy, who caught the filing. Now, an FCC listing doesn't guarantee an immediate launch, but what it does mean is that the product has been cleared for sale in the United States. That's always a huge step in the product release cycle because DJI doesn't usually let too much time pass after an FCC certification before they start teasing or rolling out the official launch. Still, it could be a matter of weeks or even months, depending on DJI's release strategy. They've been known to play the long game before, timing launches to fit with seasonal demand or to avoid clashing with other big product announcements. But what do we actually know so far about the DJI Neo 2? Well, not a lot is official just yet, but the leaks and rumors are starting to paint an exciting picture. The clearest leak we've seen so far shows a prototype model with what looks like new double-layered propeller guards. This seems like a refinement over the older Neo design, and if true, it could mean DJI is doubling down on safety and stability. For entry-level flyers, casual users, and even indoor pilots, improved propeller protection makes a huge difference. It's a feature that might look small on paper, but in practice, it makes flying far more accessible and less intimidating for beginners. Another big rumor is about the body of the Neo 2. It's said to have a lighter, redesigned frame that still keeps the compact, mini-drone identity but with a more aerodynamic and modern look. This kind of change is exactly what you'd expect from DJI. Evolution, not revolution. And the reason they might be doing this is simple. Making space for a larger camera sensor and more advanced obstacle avoidance systems. Now, let's talk about the camera upgrades because this is where a lot of excitement is building. Leaks. Suggests that the DJI Neo 2 could come with a 1 1.3-inch sensor, which is a big leap from the original Neo. If this turns out to be true, it means much sharper image quality, improved low-light performance, and better color accuracy. For content creators, vloggers, and hobbyists who want cinematic aerial shots without jumping up to the much more expensive Mavic series, this could be the sweet spot. A bigger sensor in a drone this small really changes the game in terms of accessibility and affordability. As for smart features, the Neo 2 might be getting a major boost here as well. The first generation Neo was pretty bare bones when it came to obstacle avoidance, but this time, DJI seems ready to step up. Rumors are pointing towards support for Active Track 6.0, and possibly even Focus Track. These are flagship level intelligent, flight features that allow the drone to lock onto a subject and track them smoothly avoiding obstacles in real time. If this comes to the Neo 2, it would open up professional level tracking to a whole new group of drone pilots. Imagine mountain bikers, runners, or travel vloggers being able to set this compact drone to follow them without constantly worrying about crashing. It's a massive quality of life upgrade. But of course, let's not get too carried away. The moment. A lot of this is speculation fueled by leaks, whispers, and early sightings of prototypes. Until DJI makes the official announcement, we have to take everything with a grain of salt. Still, it's worth paying attention because DJI rarely disappoints when it comes to innovation. While we wait for the Neo 2 to officially drop, DJI has plenty of other products lined up that are keeping fans excited. For example, the DJI Osmo 360, the DJI Mic 3, and the Osmo Nano are all expected soon. And of course, one of the biggest upcoming releases is the DJI Mini 5 Pro rumored to be launching on August 7th. That's a major one to watch because the Mini line has always been a favorite among drone enthusiasts who want pro-level features in a compact form factor. The DJI ecosystem is expanding fast, and the Neo 2 looks like it's going to slot perfectly into their strategy of offering something for everyone, from casual beginners to pro filmmakers. If you think about it, DJI is covering all the angles right now. Affordable entry-level drones like the Neo series Compact but powerful models like the Mini line, and of course, the high-end Mavic and Inspire series for professionals. The Neo, 
too, could easily become the go-to starter drone for new pilots who want more than just a toy, but aren't ready to invest thousands into equipment. So, what can we take away from all of this? First, the DJI NEO 2 is real, and it's making moves toward launch thanks to the FCC listing. Second, while we don't know the exact release date yet, the leaks are pointing to some very exciting upgrades. A lighter and more aerodynamic design, double-layered propeller guards, a larger 1-1.3-inch camera sensor, and advanced obstacle avoidance features with active track and focus track. Put all of that together, and you've got a drone that could dominate the entry-level market while offering serious appeal to intermediate users as well. And finally, the takeaway for drone fans. Stay tuned. DJI has a history of surprising us, and with products like the Mini 5 Pro also on the horizon, the second half of this year could be huge for drone releases. That's all for today's update on the DJI NEO 2 leaks, rumors, and FCC certification news. If you're passionate about drones, aerial photography, or just want to stay on top of the latest DJI news, make sure you subscribe to the channel because we'll be covering everything from the NEO 2 to the Mini 5 Pro and beyond. Thanks for watching, and as always, if you enjoyed the update, don't forget to drop a like, leave a comment, or share this with your fellow drone enthusiasts. Your support really helps keep this channel growing. Until next time, stay safe, keep flying, and I'll catch you in the next one!